Hey, everybody. I want to talk about um, a little thing that has been driving me crazy, and I finally figured out what it is, is if I'm on a separate computer and I have source tree, and I clone one of my projects, you begin with just the master branch, right? And so the question is, how do you get the other branches in? Uh, and I always wondered how to do that. It turns out it's right in place. As long as you have log history on here and you have all branches selected, you can see I've got this branch called period one, one called period two, one called origin video tutorial. All I have to do is double click the one that shows that branch and then I'm there. And I already did this once. Let's do it for period two. I double click it and it says check out remote branch, origin period two, new local branch name. So it automatically pulls and it looks for a branch with the title that we had there. Click OK. We got it. And then uh, as you notice, it doesn't have the period origin period one. So but I can see it here. So I double click this and it pulls in that branch as well. And now I've got all the branches that are on the remote and now I can track it. So there you go. I hope that helped you because I've been looking for that. Anyway, stay tuned for more little handy source tree tips.